trying to find the past in the mask in front of me. I'm Rose Marshak. I'm an associate professor of arts technology. I teach computer programming for artists and music business, among other things here at ISU. And uh, I'm also the bass player and computer programmer for the punk rock band Poster Children. And I'm Rick Valentin. I'm an associate professor in arts technology here at Illinois State. And um, I am the spokesman and guitar player for Poster Children. But there's a choice left underneath. I always thought we were the lucky ones. We started in 1987. Rose and I met at the University of Illinois at a dorm called Allen Hall. We would play dorm parties and then, you know, at some point we moved out of the dorm. And then we, uh, we lived in the houses around the area, you know, the campus houses, and then we would play house parties. Once in a while we would get like a show opening for a bigger band that was coming through, always punk rock bands. We played our first show in Bloomington in 1988. Yeah. While we were playing in the band, we, uh, for a while we were programming flight simulators, then we sort of quit our jobs. We, uh, we went on tour for 10 or 15 years. I was working at Cranard Art Museum for a while and, and Matthew Smith here came and rescued me um, from there, right? I'm just Matthew Smith, a colleague of mine in the Arts Technology Program, said, hey, you know, we have this position open for a music business teacher slash multimedia artist. And I was like, wow, <laughs> I guess I could fill that. I know two people who could fill that gap. And I started thinking, God, music is so important. Music, I shouldn't just be doing art and programming. Music is, is inside me. It's like, it's, it's what I was born with. I grew up playing all these different instruments. It's so important. It may seem like uh, being a teacher uh, is different than being a, a musician, a touring musician, but I've kind of realized they're very similar in a way. You're performing, but sometimes things go wrong. You're always thinking on your feet. Uh, mistakes happen, but there's always another show. When I initially started on this, I thought it was going to be two different tool sets, and there are different tool sets, but it's amazing how much it overlaps and how much um, being a performer and that everyday rehearsal, practice, and then performance um, actually ties into being a teacher. Trying to find a path through the past in front of me. Ha, 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 ha.